can't turn your back to me But I know that any minute you'll be back to me Hi there guys, it's Emily. So today I'm going to be showing you all of these clothes that I got from an online website as opposed to a real life website, you know. These are from Zoffel.com and I could have folded them or something, but I didn't. I'll have the links to all of the items that I got in the description if you want to get them as well because you probably will because they're pretty cute, so. And if you want to see lots of pictures of me wearing these clothes, you can follow my Instagram at Emily underscore Wasp. Let's just get started, you know. <laughs> Item number one is a purple sweater. Oh, how does it go? I don't know. Basically, it's one of these sweaters with the attached choker thing, but then it also has these little zippers on the sleeves And I wore it unzipped because I'm really tall and I have really long arms So when I unzip it, it makes the sleeves longer life hack I think it's a cool little detail and I've also heard that guys have been really into elbows lately So if you just unzip this and reveal your elbow, you will get a boyfriend so much easier. Let me check. Hey Are you really attracted to elbows? I love elbows no idea. I have an issue, so I got the same sweater in gray. I took a cute selfie in this sweater, so I could like that over on the gram. <laughs> Next, I got another sweater because it's really cold here. Have you seen the picture on Twitter where it's a guy's Snapchat where it's like five degrees and he's like, why can't it just be double digits? And then it goes down to negative 10 and he's like, that's not what I meant. Because that is very relatable to me. But I have really been loving these lace-up sweaters or just shirts in general lately. I watched a video about trends that need to die in 2017 and they said that lace-up should die, but it's fine. I'll keep it rolling. I'll bring it back. And because I really, really have issues with clothes. I have this sweater in gray too, but this one I have styled a little differently. I actually tied the lace-up thing in a bow here instead of letting it hang down like this. Personally, I think I like the other way better. Let me know which one you like better in the comments. Here's another sweater, what's new? This one has ties on the sides, which I think is cute, except they keep on coming undone, so I should really double knot them or something. Okay, you guys might hate this sweater. It kind of gives off 80 year old in a nursing home vibes, but I mean, that's basically me, so it's not really an issue. Honestly, I think this is adorable. I have been loving embroidered things lately. Basically, it goes with everything and it makes me look super trendy. I mean, I can always pretend. Okay, more embroidery. I love this. This is an embroidered denim skirt. I mean, you can see that. This has a little embroidered bird, some flowers and some leaves or flowers on leaves. And I think the skirt looks so cute with this top. I kind of had mixed feelings when this came in the mail. I was like, is this color gonna make me look really neutral and pale? But it ended up looking really, really good. What's kind of weird about this is that the brand is called Bradley Michelle. Um, does this remind you of anything? I mean, the quality is amazing, so I'm not gonna complain. Next, I got this dress that is so cute. More of the lace up. It also has these really cool sleeves. Are these called like bell sleeves, I believe? Kind of like bell bottoms, but on your arms. <laughs> I've actually worn this a couple times as a shirt. Because I'm almost 5'10", everything Thing is short on me. So I actually tucked this into jeans and it looked like a shirt. It was so cute. I have wanted a suede baseball cap for so long. I was in the mall and I saw one for like $30, which I was not going to pay. So I got one from Zoffel that was a lot cheaper. It's this cute gray suede. You can see it. There's a foundation stain inside because that is my life. This makes me feel like such a baddie. I did my highlight too. Can you see it? Probably not because I'm too white. When you're so white, you can use highlighter as a bronzer. If that were to work for anyone, it would work for me. And then I think this is my favorite thing that I got. It is this adorable, let me make it face in the right way. It is this silvery purpley bomber jacket. Silvery purpley are those words. Mm -mm. The quality of this material is so good. It's very satiny sort of. And it's really thick, so it's very warm. I actually did a whole photo shoot in this jacket. It, so I'll insert some of the pictures right here. The final two things didn't look that great on me, gonna be honest. I got this red velvet dress and looking at it online, I thought it would be so cute because I love the whole velvet trend going on. But for some reason, it just escaped my mind that red is not my color at all. But my friend actually tried it on and it looked amazing on her. So I'll give it to her, but it just didn't really work on me. And lastly is this shirt. It's one of these with the little 
cutout thing right here. And the material is very interesting. It feels like a swimsuit or something. It's one of those that looked great on the model and then I put it on and it was like, uh-uh. Hopefully one of my friends will like it. I'm sure they will. Anyway, that is everything that I got from Zoffel. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and turn on my notifications because YouTube is still being weird. I love YouTube. Actually, I do love YouTube. That wasn't sarcastic, but come on YouTube, figure it out. Even PewDiePie agrees with me. Make sure to check out all of my social media. All the links are always in the description. I love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye! Sometimes I walk a little